Hi everyone, I am Tuesday Stella White and I'm here with the amazing, talented Carlo Arechea. Oh, you said it so good. Thank you. <laughs> we are here in the Stella Adler Speakeasy and he is a Stella Adler alumni. Yeah. You can find him in shows such as SWAT, Graci, and El Talisman. You were saying you filmed Graci before Stella Adler, yes. but I want to ask, how did coming here to Stella Adler help you book the other shows that you've been? Oh, absolutely, yeah. yeah. I feel that I'm such a different actor before Stella and after Stella, mm -hmm. like completely. It's been almost 10 years since I haven't been back, especially in this room, and wow, it's just like so many memories. Oh, it feels good. so special, like I had such a great time here. Good, yeah. can you share one of your favorite Stella Adler Ooh. moments? Or multiple, I'm sure uh, there's a bunch. The exercise on take two mm -hmm. with Tim, especially um, we did this homeless. I don't know if you, if you I did it. I did it. Yes. Homeless exercise. It was wow. It really changed my mindset mm -hmm. because I went like all the way. In take two, they really make you go in all and, the way. Yeah, all yeah. the way. There's yeah. no like halfway doing it. Yeah. You have to do it. It's interesting because a lot of people have said that that's their favorite exercise. Yeah. I didn't understand it. Like okay. I was very. I was like, I have to oh, make it overly dramatic, mm -hmm. like do this. And then it was at the end, like just to live yeah. as a yeah. person that's not you, you know? Yeah. And so, yeah, it's, it's interesting. Imagination exercise, yeah. Yeah, especially because I love to meditate. And mm -hmm. also I feel that that kind of elevated my meditation mm -hmm. process. Mm -hmm. I feel that every class here is so unique and so special. Yeah. Like I, 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 I don't want to say this is my favorite class because every class, I feel that I learned something. Yeah. As an actor who obviously has established himself in the world of acting, you know, I've seen, I stalked your social media a little oh, bit. I've okay. seen that you were a part of the Emmys and mm -hmm. that you are a member of the Television Academy. Yes. So if you want to speak a little bit on that and how you got those amazing opportunities. Yeah. Actually, I have to put so much credit to Stella Adler because my role on, uh -huh. on, on SWAT, it was a lot of character work. Like I shaved my head, I gained uh -huh. like 15 pounds. Even though he was a Cuban boxer and I'm from Cuba, mm -hmm. I had to speak a little different. Even the accent was even bigger than this. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so it was, it, I have also, I have to learn how to box. Yes. It was a lot of character work. Yes. And I feel that Estela has helped me that, you know. Yeah. We do so much character work here. And then because of that, I was considered for an Emmy uh -huh. uh, nomination because of my, my oh, work. Amazing. Yes. yes. And then I, this year, I recently joined the Academy, the Television Academy. And this year was also my first year voting as a Television Academy member. Well, yeah. Congratulations! Thank you, thank you, thank yeah. You. yeah. And we don't have a lot of Latinos. So oh, that, representation. Yeah, yeah that's also amazing. For me, yeah. I bet you it, it's like such a heartfelt yes. thing to get to yeah, be a part yeah, of that. Yeah, 100%. Do you have any advice for new and up and coming actors, mm. such as myself and other people here at Stella Adler? I feel that really really enjoy when you're here okay. you know and, and and this is a safe place to mess it up you know to to go all the way to not hide yeah. just to really open yourself and enjoy because once you're there it's different you know mm -hmm. and have fun and, and trust your teachers and also trust yourself and believe you yes. know i feel that when the universe god plays a dream in your heart it's going to manifest you just have to keep going and do not listen to the non-sayers you know mm -hmm. there's always somebody's gonna say maybe you're not right for this but i also feel that the right roles always find you that's you know? beautiful yeah. yeah so it's just a matter of trusting mm -hmm. trusting the process you know you also need to be authentic mm -hmm. you know because i feel like let's say in the latino market for so long i wanted to look like somebody else and then I feel that when I moved to LA, I really was looking for, like, especially Stella gave me that. Because mm -hmm. I learned so much about myself. And so, as actors, you need to know who we are. Yes. You know? Oh, yeah. that's amazing. Yeah. And even in Technique One, mm -hmm. they they really get you into that place. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of, that's where I started yeah. too. And learning with Laura. About, yeah, yeah, with yeah. Laura. And learning about, like, what I love about myself and what... I need to learn and then yeah. from there how I can change yeah. it into 100%. a character, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have any fun like audition tips that you can give? When you go to the room or even when you're doing the self-tape, mm -hmm. you know, think about it that you're the one choosing. Mm -hmm. Don't think about the old, oh, they, they have the power. And yeah, they have the power, but you have the power. You're deciding, right. mm -hmm. you know what, this is what I'm bringing, 
if you don't like it or if I'm not right for the part, I'm gonna have fun. Yeah. I feel that just have fun, you know, and 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 treat yourself after. Because oh, I used nice. to yeah. be very like, oh my god, I really wanna book this. And then I will be like, I will, I will be thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. And now I'm like, I let it go, I throw away my sides and I go and get an ice cream or a mm. pizza or I just treat myself or I spend time with the people that I love, you know. Yeah. Do you think that coming here to Stella Adler helped you discover the passion more? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Because it's so easy to lose yeah. the passion or your why, why you started. Mm -hmm. You know, I always go to this, I go to Stella and I always go to this little um, memory that I have when I was a kid in Cuba. I did this it was like theater mm -hmm. and I remember that I had such a special moment with the audience and then everybody was like you know clapping and I just felt like so alive mm -hmm. you know and sometimes because you want to book and you want to make money and you want to you know always go to the next level you forget your why you yeah. forget why you started you forget your passion yeah so I think that's yeah that's good yeah and I feel like that that really resonates with yeah. me too because yeah. Right now, I think, I'm not going to say for all actors, yeah. but it is a little slow it's, in the it's industry. It's for everybody. Okay. You know, it's, it's, no, 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 for every, no, no, it's yeah. for everyone, you know. Uh -huh. We had the pandemic, and then the strikes, and then now we have the elections. So everything has been such a rocky, you yeah. know, for, for all of us, you know. Yeah, and I feel yeah. like the motivation might have been yeah. going down yeah. for some people. I started writing, mm -hmm. and I also... Um, Produce my first um, future film. Oh, congratulations! Yeah. Thank That's you, thank amazing. You. So yeah. We are now actually in post production. Uh -huh. I also want to like transition a little bit. I just don't want to act. I also want to give opportunities, you know. Mm -hmm. And it was my first um, um, movie, my executive producing a future film, and it's set release next year. So I'm very excited about it. You guys. Yeah, we have a great <laughs> cast. And we also have Leslie David Baker from The Office. Oh, nice. Um, That's he amazing. He plays a Stanley. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, so I'm very, very happy about this movie. Yeah. Can you share what the name is? It's, or is uh, it? Yeah, Unspoken Buns. Okay. Yeah. That's going to be amazing. Well, I can't yeah. wait to watch Thank it. Thank you. Save the name. Yes. And next year, yes, we'll be yes, ready yes. to see you. Yes. <laughs> I wanted to ask, where do you see yourself in five years as mm, an actor? Wow. I want to do comedy. So I really see myself doing a sitcom. Mm -hmm. um, I wanna just wanna live, just wanna just doing what I love. Yeah, that's how I see myself. You know, mm -hmm. living my purpose and, and staying happy and fulfilled. Mm -hmm. You know, and also I'm also open. So my goal is to be happy and to be fulfilled as a human being. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. yeah, stay true to yourself. Stay true yeah. to myself. Yeah. Oh, that's so beautiful. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. That's that's honestly how I feel with yeah. everything yeah. too. So yeah. I'm like, it's, yeah. it's great to hear it from yeah. someone else. And yeah. yeah. One final question. Yeah. I actually got through these pretty quickly. Oh, very nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's see. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I was going to ask, and obviously your talent is your yeah. talent, but do you think that you would have been maybe where you are today if you hadn't come to Stella Adler? No, because it was meant to be. You yeah, know? it's part of my journey. Yes, you yes. Know? So if if I take this, I have to take the whole journey. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, it will be di a different path. Yeah, and we wouldn't be here. No, we wouldn't. You know? <laughs> and you wouldn't be watching this. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that was that was my final okay, question. Okay, very nice. Yes, and thank you so no, thank much you, for you. being here, yeah, thank and you. thank you guys for watching. Yeah. Go follow him and see the rest of his amazing work.